Hi Aries, welcome to my channel. We're doing your daily is the 30 to the 31 Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Good morning, America. Good morning, world. How is everybody? <laughs> oh, I'm just happy. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Always happy. <laughs> oh, I can't get enough of this joy and good things in life, you know? It's just all about good things right now. That's what I say. <laughs> now you ask me why I'm happy. It's just when you know, you know, you know. <laughs> okay, that's what I say. All right, here we go, Aries. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. This is your daily Okay, Let's see what's going on for you guys. No, it's like you just wake up and you just, you just like, you just got this, you know? Maybe you're doing this, Aries. Like, you got it, you know? And, and I said, oh, all right, here we go, though. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Let's see. You have your King of Swords. Alrighty, cut down to the bull. Okay. Don't, ca at, don't, ca don't, don't come at me because I'm coming at you. That's the King of Swords. Okay. Determined. Queen, you know, they cut it right away. But the King of Swords has a tendency to have an energy where you don't just mess around with this person. Mm-hmm. You don't. This can be you or the other person, very determined, you know, it's like slice and dice, basically. This person has the book over there, so meaning this person knows the truth. And the truth is knowledge and power, of course. So this person has a control of their emotions and power to make sure that things go right, okay? That's the king of swords, basically. And, you know, basically the whole message is, don't come at me because I'm coming at you. Mm-hmm. All right. Let's see the other person here. Very cold, of course, you know, it's a person where, um, you know, it's like, uh, how to say this? Their coldness comes with with power and strength, of course, right? Now you're going to ask yourself, but where's the love then? I don't think this person has that yet. Alrighty, let's see what's going on there. The other person, Seven of Cups, okay. So Seven of Cups is my Rahu, your North Node, basically. Um, this is the illusion, the deception, the fears. The thinking of what you're thinking basically is happening, but it's not also. So this is defensive because of fear can be. Someone here um, also is defensive because they know what is the truth. They've seen, this is this is an energy of deception, okay? Because this person can be um, an energy where, how to say that, they give things to you and only for it not to materialize. Because again, it's not real. Anything with the Seven of Cups is not real until they identified the love, the Ace of Cups, okay? And normally, that comes, okay, if they have finished their K2, basically, okay? Let me see the other person here. The, okay, look at that. There's the message. They've been watching the other person. You probably caught someone, you know, um, giving you this illusion, Okay. This energy watching the other person. I'm watching you. Watching you. Okay. That's this energy. Watching you. Okay. You could be doing this to this person. Okay. You have to be very careful if you're if you're this, okay? Because this person doesn't play no jokes. And this person is all about jokes. Okay. Let me see the other person here. Four of Pentacles. Okay. A smug, a person who's greedy, a person who hides stuff. Look how weak this person is, you know. You could be connected to someone who's weak with regards to their emotions, so they hide it. You could be connecting to someone who basically, um, you know, it's like their energy is about, um, it's all about them. It can be a self-centered person because the Four of Pentacles has to protect themselves. It is self-centered, but it is also like they want to assure themselves. It's self-assuring. That's why chances are this person lies because uh, they they want to play the safe side also. But someone here has been observing. Okay. Observing. That's a message also. Let me see here. Now this person may act dumb. Okay. This person may act dumb. But they're not. Because they're putting a front over there. Let me see here. Under the king of swords. Two of pentacles here. A cycle keeps going, you know, they're allowing this. Someone is just allowing this situation to go back and forth right now. Two of Pentacles for me, of course, twos are crossroads. So there's an energy where it's like, all right, let's see where this goes. Let's see where this goes. Okay. 
that's the king of swords and with with this uh person who's allowing it they're not there just for no reason they know they see and when they know and they see it's just a matter of time for this person to just cut it off mm -hmm. it ain't pretty slice and dice that's what i say here it ain't pretty someone could be doing this to you or you're doing this to someone vice versa ace of swords ace of the king look at that remember that's a 360 turn the king will not hesitate here to tell them the truth someone here just has to admit the truth of whatever that they're hiding whatever they're keeping from the king they have to communicate they have someone here has to come out basically how to say that come out from their hiding because this is a person who's hiding stuff with the four of pentacles okay and it's a seven of cups energy where yep there it is you got to come out of the hiding you got to speak up the truth because someone here got found and let me see i'm going to continue this reading with the 30 to the 31st sun moon rising venus and jupiter thank you very much guys for watching okay as this person speaks up the truth and this is also this might severe the ties already because the you know remember the other person is just allowing it now basically either it gets cuts off or it moves forward all right thank you very much Aries. i'll see you guys again and bye